we observed something very interesting about the timing of anemia. And so for mothers who were diagnosed with anemia rather early on in pregnancy, before the 30th week, we saw that they were more likely to have a child with autism and or ADHD or intellectual disability. Whereas the mothers who were diagnosed later on in pregnancy, after the 30th week of pregnancy, were, were not more likely to have a child with any of those neurodevelopmental disorders. And so we really think that anemia earlier in pregnancy versus later in pregnancy is a very different sort of thing. would then want to um, screen more for anemia. This is already done. Uh, m uh, midwives measure women's uh, hemoglobin levels in their blood already oftentimes from the very first visit, and that's very important. But this could also be something more like folic acid, where women who are thinking about becoming pregnant, it might be wise for them to also consider what their uh, iron intake is in their diet, and if they're concerned about it, see their doctor and have it checked before they even become pregnant. Once you're pregnant, it's actually very hard to increase the iron levels in the blood if iron is the root cause of the anemia.